jumping right into it. Um, the nailless nail knot. We showed the process of this on Killing Chronomids on YouTube and there was a huge amount of comments saying thanks. I think this version will be a little more clear and detailed. So jumping right into it, uh, we're gonna go through this. It's also called the knot for those that wanna get technical about books and names and all of that. Um, the number two most asked knot is the Bimini twist and I'm not gonna do that. But I have tested this knot on tarpon, salmon, and for stillwater fly fishing, as a backing to line or leader to fly line knot, uh, this is super handy. You don't need a tool. You can do it out there in five seconds. So let's get her done. Okay, fly line and heavy part of a tapered leader. Ooh, the worst stuff, right? Not really. So again, holding it in my left hand, just having it wrap over that my hand like this, holding it in that position, bringing the monofilament or the backing right past the join, letting a loop form and pinching all three sections. Pretty simple, okay? So you're basically just holding a loop on top of it. Out the back, through towards me in the loop. Once, twice, three times, four times, and five. Now's the crucial part. Keep everything tight when you pull to form this knot together. So here we go. Slides it down, there it is. You see that? Right there. So before you give it a real good tightening, slide it about an inch to the base of your fly line, to the end there, so you don't waste too much, but you also want some, some room there in case you slip. Give it a good, good pull test. There it's sitting. Okay, easy. Now a clip job on it. Same thing, leave a little bit more of a tag on the mono part. I cut a, a bit of a taper to it. Here it is, super fast, super easy.